everyone. Welcome back to the channel. If you're looking for a free and open source media server to organize and stream all your movies, TV shows, music, and more, then you've come to the right place. Today, we're going to show you how to install Jellyfin on Ubuntu 24.04. It's an easy and powerful way to manage your media library, so let's dive right in. First things first, let's make sure your Ubuntu system is up to date. Open your terminal and type the following commands. Jellyfin isn't available in the default Ubuntu repository, but it provides its own dedicated repository. To add the Jellyfin repository to your Ubuntu system, run the following command. You will find the long commands in the video description. Next, run the following command to import the Jellyfin GPG key into your Ubuntu system. This allows APT to verify the integrity of the packages during installation. This command enables APT to securely download packages over HTTPS and ensures that the system can authenticate those connections using trusted certificates. Now that we've added the repository, let's install Jellyfin first. Refresh the package list again. You can check the status to make sure it's running correctly with this command. Press the Q key to take back control of the terminal. If the service is not running, you can use this command to start it. With Jellyfin up and running, we can now access the web interface to set it up. Open your browser and navigate to the IP address of your server, or if you are on the server, you can access using localhost or 127.0.0.1 loopback address. Here, you'll be greeted by the Jellyfin setup wizard. Just follow the on-screen instructions to create your admin account and start adding your media. Now you can add libraries. Click Add Media Library button. Since I have installed on my VPS, let me connect using an FTP and create a folder for movies.
you can add more folders if you want. Your movies will appear here. Let me add one video file. To be able to access the Jellyfin web interface remotely and securely, we can set up a reverse proxy for Jellyfin with Engine X. Now create a server block file for Jellyfin and paste the following in the file. Replace jellyfin.example.com with your own domain name. Additionally, make sure to create a DNS A record for this subdomain. If you don't have a domain name yet, I suggest checking out Name Cheap. The link is in the video description. They offer affordable pricing and include Free Lifetime, who is privacy protection. Test Engine X configuration using the command I already run above, then reload Engine X for the change to take effect. To secure your HTTP traffic when accessing the, the Jellyfin server externally, you can enable HTTPS by installing a free TLS certificate from Let's Encrypt. To do this, run the following command to install the Let's Encrypt client certbot on Ubuntu 24.04. Also install the certbot engine X plugin.
run the following command to obtain and install TLS certificate. Now, we can access the server using HTTPS. And there you have it. Jellyfin is now installed and ready to go on your Ubuntu 24.04 system. From here, you can start adding your media libraries and streaming them across all your devices. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tutorials like this one. And as always, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.